Hi everyone. I just woke up. Who's the water dude? This is my personal alarm clock waking me up every morning and night. Um, but it is Friday. I'm supposed to get my uniform today. So let me get her settled down myself. I'm going to try to get myself situated and then we'll be out to the store. For some reason, our new thing is I feed her. No. And then she puts her, <laughs> her thumb back in her mouth. That's her new thing. Uh oh, yeah. I just wait. She'll take it out, eat, and bloop. Oh, girl, you didn't even swallow that one. Like I was saying earlier, today at 9, I have to go get my uniform. Yay, finally, then I can show you guys everything that I have. Here, mama. Here. And then I also need to stop by the library to see if my books came in. Hopefully they did because I will get basically $400 in free books. And I'll only have to come out of pocket with like two, 300 for the rest rather than pay like... 700 maybe even 800 dollars i think it was 700 um all my books i did find out yesterday that i can purchase online so i'm super happy about that and um i also am hoping that my financial aid kicks in i was told that i will be getting my financial aid on friday however i was really skeptical of that because we all know how the banking system works like sometimes well I guess it depends on what time they release it to the bank but I'm more thinking I'm gonna get it on like Monday or Tuesday but they told me I would get it today so so far I have not gotten it so I need to call the financial aid office and see what time they're gonna be giving me my financial aid so I can get this on a roll Okay, really? <sighs> I have so much, so much to do. It's crazy. Hey, Mama. That's it's my tablet over there. <coughs> so she can watch it after I finish feeding her. I'm going to try to wash my face brush my teeth and stuff and get ready because she's basically already ready and she needed to change her onesie she's had her cream put on her she's had her diaper changed okay mama um for the yesterday i did not do any homework um, I have two chapters to read of my nursing program and like some orientation. Um, the orientation is for my clinicals. That is not due until September. But um, I'm not doing any more homework this summer because I feel like I've been working really hard and this can either be good for me because it'll be a mental break. Or it can be horrible because I'll be kicking myself in the butt later when I'm like trying to cram everything in. But I just, I don't have any more like ability in me to sit here and study and take notes. I just, I don't. So, um, we're going to see how that goes. I'm going to finish feeding her, get ready, and then... I'll be on my way to pick up my uniform. Okay, guys. So I came back from getting my uniform 
and I want to show you guys what I got. I was like super, super stoked about this. I'm kind of still excited, but now I'm honestly kind of over it because I'm just stressed out with everything. I'm worried about how I'm going to get my books and all that. Okay, but let me go ahead and show you guys um, my uniform and my stethoscope and all of that jazz. Um, this was just like a cute little pin that I got and it kind of looks like um, a blood draw needle. I I'm assuming that's what this would be. I don't know. Maybe it's a needle with some, supposed to be a needle with some medicine in it, but I just thought that was really cute. Then I also have this um, Hitley's name like badge holder and it has an A on it for Leah and it's retractable. So it actually pulls out pretty long. You just uh, clamp your name your badge that we're supposed to get I believe on the first day of school through here clip it on clip this on to your badge and then boom you are done and the other thing that I got and this is already open was my prestige medical watch it's all white and uh, we're required to have a watch and it can't be a watch like an apple watch or anything it just has to be a regular faced watch non-electronic i guess you could say and then i have my stethoscope and it is just a litman stethoscope in the lavender color um they were giving one ones out where we picked up our uniform those were black but i had already gotten this one so we are gonna use this one for this semester um okay that's all the little stuff that i got let me put this away okay we're just gonna throw everything up right here there we go the next thing that i want to show you guys were my nursing shoes i probably was most excited for these shoes because I, I had a job at the hotel and so I know what it was like to stand up all day and be on your feet. So I wanted to make sure that my shoes were comfy. But these are the shoes. They're all white, no logo or anything that is required. Um, we're required to have them be wipeable and like non-absorbent and as well they have to be non-slip, which these are. So those are my nursing shoes. I did get some compression socks as well, all black. Um, and I've, I've worn my shoes and I've worn my compression socks around the house just to make sure that they're nice and comfy. So that is why it's kind of all over the place. Okay, put that up. The next thing that I want to show you guys is not specifically for nursing, but I got it uh, with one of my school programs, and it is um, a backpack. I got it with our EOPS program. I'm not sure if they have this program at every school, but I know every school that I've heard of in Southern California and Northern California, obviously, they have the EOPS program. So I don't know if that's just a California thing or not. I don't know if other schools have them, but if I suggest people finding out about it because they pay for your books um, and they give you a backpack, school, school supplies, cash incentives, like a whole bunch of other things for getting good grades. To qualify, I think you just have to have one parent have gone to school and um, yeah, I think that's it. And maybe be a mom because i never used to qualify for it this was my first time qualifying for it so this is my first really semester starting being a mom so maybe that's what qualified me i have no clue um but the next thing i want to show you guys was just this duffel bag we were required to get this um we're required to carry it with us to class and to our clinicals we cannot carry any other bag this little bag right here was like $40 and it is just a regular little, um, what do you call it, tote bag. Like, honestly, you can get this probably for like $10 at Target or Walmart. But 
it was like $40. And right now it has my uniforms in there. I'm gonna go ahead and take these out and show you guys in just a second. I didn't really know a better way to show you guys. Um, but this is basically my uniform. It's just literally a white little um, shirt. It has two pockets on the side. One right here and one right here. And then my school logo is under that sleeve. And yeah, that's basically my shirt. Um, I got a 2X because I wanted to make sure that it fits. And it's a little big, but you know, that's not a problem. We're going to be wearing undershirts under these anyway. So that is my shirt. Let me show you guys my hey pants. Guys. So these are my pants. I got a 2X in these as well. And they as well are a little big, but I can like tighten it with these little straps right here. Um, and they're all black. There's no logo on them or anything. We were required to get these pants through this specific store. I know a lot of people, they um, can get like dicky scrubs or, you know, as long as their scrubs are a certain color, they're allowed to have them. But our school, we're, or maybe a lot of other schools too, because I think a lot of other schools have the logo on them. But simple pocket on this butt cheek. Oh my God, there's only one butt cheek pocket. We only got one po pocket, y'all, on the back. I thought there would have been two. But just Uno, not that I really use back pockets, but yeah. And then let me show you our coat. So this is my coat right here. <laughs> my daughter woke up, so she's probably gonna be crying in a minute. But just to really quick show you guys, this is our lap coat. Um, it's basically the same thing as a shirt, except it buttons up all the way down. We have two pockets on the front and it is all white. The school logo is under the sleeve. And that is basically my uniform. I'm gonna try it on really quick for you guys so you guys can get a look at how your girl looks in it. All right, I'll be okay, back. guys, so I just wanted to show you really quick what uh, my uniform looks like on excuse my hair. I know it looks a mess, but anyway This is what it looks like on guys. I wish I had someone that was here who can like show the full the Full little fit, but yeah, this is what it looks like on it feels so comfy. I feel so official <laughs> um, Yeah, and this is my name clip thing um, I'm assuming that's where I'm gonna be putting it when I get my little bag and that is it oh yeah i have one more thing to show you guys i forgot was in my bag but let me put on my jacket too so we can see how the jacket looks over um the shirt i think this is extra fabric that they forgot to cut off like when they put the logo on so yeah like come on now i paid too much for this uniform to be having these little malfunctions so this is with my with my coat on i just <laughs> I feel so official guys I feel like a real nurse but I don't I don't know nothing right now um but this is what my jacket on and my pants my little shoes I did not put my compression socks on because they're long and it take it's like hard to put them on in a rush and my daughter's awake so I know she's gonna be crying for me in a little bit but yeah Look at me. Don't I look like I can be like, hi, how may I help you? How are you feeling today? Um, but yes, so this is everything. I need to get some earrings and I'm gonna wear my necklace to clinicals. I only have one necklace. My mom had got me this when I graduated from elementary, elementary to middle school, my promotion. But, um, yeah, so I'm gonna wear a necklace. I'm gonna give me some little studs, you guys. My little hair is gonna be presentable. And your girl is gonna be going to clinicals on Monday. Oh yeah, and let me show you this other little thing that I got. Let's stuff on our more melt it into a little chocolate drop puddle. It's so hot with this jacket on because it's summer. But anyway, so this is the other thing that was in my nursing bag that I completely forgot about. This is like, I forgot what they call it, a pocket packet. I don't know where it's supposed to attach to. Um, maybe my pants? 
I have no clue. I don't know. I don't know. Like, maybe this is to put your pins in and stuff. That's what I would assume it's for because I can't imagine what else I would use this for. Um, then we got this little pin, which you can get anywhere. And then we have this thing. And up, oh, that's baby. This is a light. I haven't figured out how to use it. I've tried clicking this and it doesn't like turn on. So I'm not really sure how to turn it on, but that's the other thing that came. And then randomly I got this. <laughs> this wasn't in a package or anything and I don't remember ordering this. So I don't know if this is something that I need or something that might have felt out of here. Um, but my first thought was that it was like to cut fabric because of how it's like it is but I don't know my mom was saying maybe it was for gauze but I, I definitely don't know so I'm just take this on the first day of school too um and we're gonna see what it's for but that is everything that I got um I do need to get some undershirts though for this uniform right now I just have the shirt that I was wearing but we're required to wear white undershirts under our nursing shirts our nursing uniform shirts i also need to get um some more socks and there's a couple other things that i wanted to get to put in my nursing bag and then i will do a what's in my nursing bag um for school because i don't have like notebooks so i have one and i do have a couple pencils and things like that but I wanted to get like, you know, some hand sanitizer, some gum, some cute little stuff to put in here so I can show you guys. Stay tuned for that video. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like this video, subscribe, and look out because I post on Sunday, Tuesday, and Fridays, okay? So, watch out for those videos, guys. Really quick, I forgot to mention with the uniforms, I feel like if you wash them, they're gonna turn into Barbie doll clothes. So. I don't know if that's just how scrubs feel or like if it's just the scrubs that my school is making us get but they feel like um, if you wash and dry them they're gonna shrink really badly so I am happy that I got a bigger size so hopefully when I do dry my scrubs they don't shrink up so much